Could you walk us through just a, a quick 60 seconds of what a day in the life of a SIM and threat hunter would look like? So um, in case of SIM, there are a lot of roles which come into picture because SIMs fall into security operations. So in mm -hmm. under security operations team, you have an incident responder. You have a SARC analyst and different levels of analysts, like analyst one, analyst two. Then mm -hmm. we, you might have a malware analyst in the team, a threat intelligence analyst in the team. So there are different operations which a SOC team is doing using the SIM. And let's mm -hmm. let's pick up one of them. So as a SOC tier one analyst, you mm -hmm. would be mostly working on some of the real-time alerts which are being generated in the SIM. You would be working on to resolve those alerts. If some of those alerts are high-end alerts, which are critical, you will be analyzing them and then passing on to the next level of analyst, which is the second level of analyst. So see the SOC tier one analyst are mm -hmm. the ones which which are starting with the SOC team, uh, with okay. the basic knowledge of SOC. And they start to un understand the tool, the dashboard, the working of alerts, um, threat intelligence, like basic understanding of the tool and how to go about uh, threat detection. Not proactive threat detection, but reactive threat detection in terms of alerts analysis okay. and further performing alert triage. So that's that's what mostly a SOC analyst does. And mm -hmm. they, they then further coordinate with different analysts in the team. As I said, for example, if something is critical, they resolve, resolve it at their end and then provide their notes and escalate to the second level of the senior SOC level. Okay. And then uh, when the senior SOC level, they, these are the ones who are, who are more involved in the threat hunting. That's so true. okay. If somebody is a threat hunter, they are like they are more likely to be on the senior side of SOC because they are mm, proactively okay. involved. They are more experienced, and their role is is more around looking for threats proactively in the environment.